Echo Tastes. We're going to eat a meal. We're going to start with a small can of kimchi. Then we're going to move on. Some of us have not tried Kipper Snacks. And then finally, <laughs> to eat this Which I believe says on the back. <laughs> Kelp jelly. <laughs> I just needed to open it. So I'm going to open it. Okay. Down. There's no light right there. I don't really want to smell it yet because I'm not eating it right now. Okay, I'm going to pause then. <laughs> I was gonna pop. No, disgusting. <laughs> Wait, let me get it. Mistaking? What is it? Oh, that's. Did you have No, no, it is what it is. That that is what it's supposed. To. It it, tastes, it looks right, better if it's fresh. Here, okay. You know. It, okay. Really? Oh my gosh, it's got little nerds in it. <laughs> All right, yeah, I guess it's. Do you guys know how they make that, by the way? Oh, I see. It's the cabbage. The cabbage is evidently called kimchi because we were behind a lady <laughs> who was Korean who was buying a kimchi. So it looks like it's the bottom of the cabbage. Here are the leaves. And then it's in whatever sauce they made. See what we do for fun? Stoop. Oh, that's a big Oh, I do for fun. It's there. Eat it. Oh, my gosh. All it's, right. It's not well. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it smells kind of a little bit spicy, but a little bit like tomato sauce. So, Alright, here I go. Do you guys know how it's made? Do you? Yes. They boil cabbage in something and then let it sit for like seven years. <laughs> Tell us how it's made. Oh, no, uh, yeah, that is what they do. Um, they just take it. <laughs> no. They take it, they cook the cabbage, <laughs> then they put it in these stone pots. And then they stick it in the ground for a couple of months and just let it ferment down there in the ground. And then once you take it out, you have kimchi. Are you not taping? I'm taping, yeah. <laughs> I was following you. <laughs> All right, ready? I'm going to eat it because they put it in a pot. Okay. <laughs> you got Harold? Spicy. Is it spicy? <laughs> Ew. It didn't go down all the way. Oh. <clears throat> okay, it's not awful. And this is also canned. I'm taking that into account. So it's soggy yeah. than probably it should be. Yeah. It's got some bite to it. Not that's not hugely bad, but yes, it has some bite. It slightly reminds me of that stoop. Maybe that's also a mental thing that I'm getting by. Um and I got a taste of sauerkraut. Which I guess is the cabbage part. Mm. I am not a fan, but that being said, I would try if someone had it more like a fresher thing rather than canned. But it tastes exactly like I imagined it would. Ew. Yay! Okay. Now it's your turn. <laughs> okay, I've had um, kimchi before at this uh, Korean place my friend took me to in Syracuse. It's actually the first time I ever had it, and he's like, you gotta try it, and I'm like, oh, it looks scary, and he's like, yeah, and I'm like, okay. So, I do like it. Um, I'm not sure how the can tastes compared to the fresh, but we'll see. Well, that'd be a good test then to tell us. Oh, crunchy. It tastes more pickled. Mmm. And it's not as... It's noisy. Yeah. <laughs> I had a giant piece of it. You did. It's not bad, but I prefer it fresh, definitely. Because it has a less pickle, like it's been sitting in mm -hmm. a can taste. Now, it's served cool or just lukewarm? Cold. Cold. Mm -hmm. So this is pretty close to temperature? Yeah, this is about room temperature. And it's actually served colder. But our room is, like, freezing, But so. it does it taste better. <laughs> When it's colder. And, yeah, it is spicy, but it's not as spicy. Yeah. I guess from the can, it's lacking the amount of flavor that mm -hmm. 
it normally is. But then again, the people who made it, it was like we went to like this house, but it was an actual restaurant. But it, it was literally so it was a house. A Korean and it was like lady in just their made kitchen. it. Yeah, like they sit in the same room as you. Like we'd be over here eating, and they'd be over there sitting and talking, and their kitchen would be right behind them. Hmm. So that's scary. But it's a pretty popular place on SU campus. So. Um, oh, so is that a shout out for Korean House on the SU campus? Korean House on the SU campus. I don't know what your name is, but you rock! Woo! I'm having it all I can. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's not bad. Okay. Okay. Forget to smell it. <laughs> it smells like pickled okra. It has that pickled taste. Yeah, sour cream. Mm, spicy. I don't know how spicy I got. Um, yeah, right now I'm, like, I'm just tasting spicy tomato. Not tomato, but like tomato sauce. Yeah, it's just really spicy. It hurt me. Oh. <laughs> it's not bad. If it were a little bit more mild, I would actually enjoy it. It didn't taste bad at all to me. Okay. So maybe fresh? Yeah, I would try it again fresh to see. If, I mean, like that, if it's that spicy, then I would not be able to have more than one or two bites of it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the, no, oh my gosh, it looks scary. It looks like meat. That's my first impression. Like, it looks like a piece of what, beef or something. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> it looks like the lettuce to me. It's spicy. It tastes like something weird you just eat at a restaurant, like, like your mom, like, here, try this, it's really good, it's good for you, and you're like, no. And then, it, yeah. You know, like, Would you eat it again if it were fresh? Probably not. So you'd be able to tell people, no. Oh. Yeah, I'd be like, no, don't eat it, don't eat it. It's, it's really tomato-y, like, like if you squeeze out a tomato and then it's like the juice, it's not like a tomato soup. And then it's, it's spicy, like I have a, it's like I have a hole in my tongue. And then it's just like the consistency is bad. It's just like <laughs> crunching, but it's supposed to be smushy or something. It's cabbage, so. Yeah. And not, not, not awful. If I was starving t to death and dying, I mean, <laughs> I'd definitely... For the last can of anything on earth. <laughs> See, for me, it was like one of those things, kind of like sushi, where you just, you try it and it's like, eh, this isn't bad, but... You know, I'll eat it some more, <clears throat> and then you just get used to the taste, and it's like really good. I thought it tasted good. I would, I would continue eating it, except for it's too spicy. It yeah. would burn my tongue. But if it's, it's if it's served cold and if it's made right, then it's it's really good. So. It, it, it's like heroes. It tastes like it would be okay. I guess. I guess. I guess. I can't give it as much credit because it's in the can. I have to give more credit because it's in the can. I, stoop was that weird cabbage soup diet, which was nothing like it, but it was soup with, made with cabbage, and that mentally is... Ugh. Your turn! This is um, Ben... What was it? No, uh, Rainbow, Rainbow Dash. Dash. Rainbow Dash, yes. His first, his first Echo tastes. Echo anything, actually. What a non-reaction. <laughs> He's thinking about it. <laughs> So? It's like spicy tomatoes. <laughs> <laughs> That's all you need to say. <laughs> Would you eat it again? No. Okay. <laughs> well, thanks for eating it this time. All right. All right, now we're on to Kippers.